Now, this is how you replace a Euro cylinder in a dead lock case. This is actually meant to be in a door, but obviously I can't do it because I'm in a work vice. And that's the edge of the door normally, and that sits flush. So I'm going to try and change it for one of these. There's a, turn, a thumb turn one end. So all we're going to do is a screw here that's always the same position. It lines up with the centre of that flat part of the body, the cylinder. So undo that screw. And then the lock still won't come out because there's a, a small black piece like that there that normally protrudes a bit as an extra safety precaution in case someone takes, you know, if the screw falls out, the lock still won't slide out. And you, so all you've got to do, you've got to turn the key. If you put the key the other side, it'll be a lot easier. Put the key here, you can see easier. Right. So it won't come out because there's you know, that black part's blocking it. So what you've got to do, put the key in, and pull it as you turn the key slightly. All of a sudden you'll find it's gone flush there, and you can remove it easily. So that's flush now, you see. That's why it came out. And obviously, do the same thing, make that flush, put it back in, do the screw back up, job done.